When two of the world's biggest slingshot companies collaborate, you know it's going to be special. Today we're going to get a little sneak peek of what they came up with. So stick around. Welcome back to the channel everyone. Today I've got something really huge to share with y'all. Whether you're a slingshot enthusiast, a collector, you just like high quality gear, get ready because you're about to see something truly awesome. I introduce to you the latest version of the Wendigo Slingshot, a killer collaboration between Omega Slings and Wasp Slingshots. This beauty is about to hit the market and trust me, you don't want to miss out. Okay, right out the box, this thing looks awesome. I do like the Omega Wasp logo there. Feels durable, tough, feels pretty indestructible actually. Looks sweet. Um, this can be wrap and tuck. You can wrap and tuck bands on this and it is ambidextrous. It is a right hand or a left hand hold. If your hands are big enough, you can pinch it. It is made for brace. This is for your top finger and this is made for your thumb brace. It does have a lanyard hole. I always rock a lanyard because I drop stuff a lot and that's how I store my slings by the lanyard. I usually hang them up. If you're a beginner and you're not great at wrap and tuck or you just or you're or if you're just impatient and want to change your bands quickly or easily, this frame is compatible with the aluminum wasp Enzo clips. And these are like six or seven bucks. But they take literally they take about twenty seconds to put on. And you are ready for bands. I'm gonna get some specs on this thing. Fork tips are about 25 millimeters. Fork width, 90. And overall, we're looking around 121 millimeters. Thickness, thickness we're gonna be around 13. All right, we're lanyarded up, banded up. Time to take this thing out and use it for what it was made for. Let's go test this beast out. <clears throat> Before I forget, you will get five color choices in this frame. I'll put them over here. You get the blue that you see here, black, orange, OD green, and Moonstone. Catchbox just got some new wasp targets that I ordered from Omega. So we're gonna try to get the first hits on those today. All right, it's time to get down to business. Got this thing decked out with Omega 0.5 electric white because why not? 10 meters, 11 yards, 33 feet, however you wanna call it. We're gonna throw some steel down range, see how the Wendigo performs. Can down. First hit on the uh, 40 there. Let's see if we can go down the ladder and get the blue 25. Oh, missed it. Again. These are my first shots of the day, so that's my excuse. There we go, 25 down. Now we're gonna try to hit that green 12 and a half. Oh, just above it. Got it, second shot. I actually enjoy shooting those little tiny ones over the big ones. Now we're gonna go over and go up the ladder. that one go for the green got it didn't take long to get warmed up and this thing shoots perfect this thing shoots great yellow 12 and a half oh just below it had a few in my pocket still trying to hit that 25 or that 12 and a half <clears throat> Got it. This thing is sweet. Fits my hand perfect. Shoots awesome. I think I broke this thing out my third shot. I was on target and it's been lights out ever since. So I do have a golf ball hanging here. There is a golf ball there and the wiffle ball, of course. Let's see if we can hit that golf ball. All right, the easy 
wiffle ball. Got it. I did load up a couple of those um, slapper targets with some poppers that I used in a previous video. Let's see if I can pop those for you guys. Oh, love that sound. Got it. So the new Wendigo will drop on November 29th. Keep your eyes out because I got a feeling these are going to go super fast. Don't forget to like uh, Omega and Wasp on all their socials. I'll leave all that info in the description. Uh, go check out Chuck and Steel, Mikey Paul. Go check out their channels. I had a lot of fun shooting this frame. I think you guys will have a lot of fun shooting this frame. This thing's pretty awesome. Hope you liked this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. And hopefully I catch you on the next one.